world was crushed because the Army was all I knew. And I'm like, well, what am I gonna do now? You know, I still, I guess it's just the whole thing about being part of something, being some part of something bigger. You know, a team, a family. And I have been doing this for nine years. And I'm like, what, what do I do now? Me personally coming to Army Trials, it gives me another opportunity to compete for the United States, uh, compete for the Army. And, you know, hopefully from here I can, you know, uh, kind of restart my adaptive career and, you know, continue maybe someday get back to the Paralympics and wear red, white, and blue on my back again. My dad was for some worry games and trials. I mean, with my recovery, it saved my life. You know, I was in a bad spot. Um, and I had a guy one day, just, I don't know, they say things happen for a reason. He caught me in the hallway and he kind of was like, hey man, if you're scared to play, don't come and play. And ever since then, I've been the trials, the games, and I'm just being competitive again has saved my life. It, I, was, I was pretty frustrated when I first had to get retired because I, I didn't want to. I, I didn't want to leave Iraq. I, when I was injured, I was fully conscious. I was awake when they had to amputate me. And, I couldn't have any pain medicine because I had lost so much blood. And I remember yelling at my company commander, and he's telling me, you need to go home. And I still had my trigger finger, sergeant, or sir, and uh, I didn't want to leave my guys. I felt like I had failed the mission, and I felt like I was abandoning them. I feel like I'm not forgotten by the Army. I feel like I'm still a part of the Army somehow, and I'd like to hope I can still help contribute to give something back. And, and serve in a small way, um, even if it's just letting freshly injured amputees, burn victims, PTSD, whatever level of injuries, I, I never compare injuries, pain is pain. Um, and I think it would be, it feels good to know that they can see a triple amp and say, hey, maybe I can give this a shot, maybe. And I see them and I say, oh, I can give that a shot too. And we, we just pick each other up just as if we were in a line unit. Everybody comes out and supports. You guys are awesome. The staff, the, the squad leaders, the cadre, the coaches are amazing. And most of all, the athletes, you know. It wouldn't be possible without the athletes. And, you know, go team Army and let's go down to Tampa and win some butt. You know you're here for a reason. There's so many people who could.